Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. 90 Day Fiance The other way is Kirsten is better off. Without Julio? Yes, she is. Since Julio Boya has taken Kirsten Showmaker for granted during 90 Day Fiance, the other way season 5, it's better that they aren't together anymore. Kirsten Shoemaker and Julio Moya from 90 Day Fiance. The other way broke up after a disagreement, which is a blessing in disguise. The 24-year-old Dutch woman and the 27-year-old New York man initially formed a great relationship. They met online, spent time together, and planned to settle in the Netherlands after tying the knot. Unfortunately, things changed when Kirsten flew to the United States for Julio. She began seeing red flags that made her wonder if he truly loved her. At the same time, Julio became more concerned about moving to a foreign country and started re-evaluating the relationship. Kirsten and Julio slowly fell apart throughout their time on 90 Day Fiance. The other way season 5, Julio started listening to his mother and relatives and grew concerned about starting a new life in the Netherlands. In the couple's final episode together, Julio admitted he couldn't move after he called Kirsten. He said he wanted to work on stuff with his family before moving. As expected, Kirsten was furious that Julio wasted her time for months. She broke down in tears and broke up with him. While Kirsten couldn't make it work with Julio, it's probably for the best. She deserved a real man and someone who wanted to build a future with her. Julio was mostly concerned about himself throughout the relationship. Julio didn't care much about Kirsten or forming a family. He was more worried about moving to the Netherlands as evidenced by his sudden change of plans. If Kirsten had married Julio, she would have regretted being with him. It would have resulted in them getting a divorce, which is far more tedious than a breakup. Kirsten was the only supportive one in the relationship. When she went to the United States and learned that Julio was having second thoughts about her, she didn't get angry. She politely gave him another chance to prove his love. Julio kept insisting on how Kirsten should consider moving to the U.S. despite knowing that their relationship started on a promise that he would live with her in the Netherlands. However, Kirsten still didn't lash out or give up on their relationship. If she had continued the relationship, Julio would have only asked more from her and given nothing in return. Julio gave up on his relationship too easily. Had he shown some resistance and tried to work things out, it would have been worth a try for Kirsten to do the same for him. However, Julio proved that he didn't love her like a real man would, so it made sense for Kirsten to give up on him in return. Things would have ended poorly for the pair if they had somehow tied the knot. A breakup is the best outcome for the 90-day fiance. The other way couple, especially Kirsten. Thanks for watching.